Welcome to our daily Bible devotional. Today we're going to ask the question, does God have a plan for me or am I just lucky some days? We'll start this by going to the book of Jeremiah and chapter 29 and verse 11 and we read together, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. We often misuse this text and try to make it apply to every situation, everybody, but truly it was given to a specific person in a specific condition, and we make it into some universal principle. I don't think this is right. God meant this for Jeremiah. However, I do believe that God has a plan for our life and for all of his people. I like to believe that I always understand that, but I know I don't. Sometimes I get confused about my days also. Sunday and Monday of this past week, September 18th and 19th of 2022, was just such a time for me. While on the island of Puerto Rico, my son and I knew a storm was headed our way, but I thought it would pass. It always does. Well, almost always. Sometimes, like this time, a storm turned into a hurricane. But we seemed to be doing okay. We couldn't get out of our house, but we liked football, and it was Sunday, so we thought we'd watch football, and we did. But all of a sudden, about 1 o'clock or so, our Wi-Fi went out. No problem. Jeremy figured out how to use our cell phones as a router, and we sent the picture to our TV anyway, and we watched it. We watched it until about 10.30 that night, and boom, no Wi-Fi, no power, everything was darkness. We didn't know it, but all along we were just running on a backup generator. And when it was gone, it was gone. And we stumbled to our beds and slept in the heat. The next morning, we got up and somehow through talking to people, we got our power back up because it was just a switch somewhere about 1030. But we didn't know how long it would last. And so we knew, like everybody else on the island, we really wanted to get off of the island. But there were no tickets available to anywhere. It seemed that way, but Jeremy spent about three hours and he finally found us tickets off of the island. And we got on the plane at 3.30 in the afternoon and were home by 8 o'clock that night. It's amazing. When I got home, though, I still had no Wi-Fi, even here in Texas. You just never know. But God knows. God does have a plan for you and a plan for me. When you have one of those days, and I know you have, and you know what? Sometimes a lot even worse. I have. When you just can't adjust the day, though, you need to learn to adjust your attitude. You see, I know that God works in my life and he works in your life. He works in the big things, uh, the birth of babies, the beginning of marriages, life and death. But God also works even in the small things of our life.